Okay, we've made it into the city of Philadelphia. Uh, we were in the inner city just a little while ago. I was trying to get some skyline shots, but the traffic is so heavy, it's hard to, to stop and do anything. I did get one really good shot of downtown, but I couldn't video it, so maybe I'll throw it in uh, <clears throat> as a still fic uh, picture. We're going to head back into the city now. We're gonna be meeting up at the Constitution Center, see the Liberty Bell, uh, go see Independence Hall. Philadelphia's kind of grown on me over the years. The first time or two I was here, I wasn't a huge fan of it, but it's starting to, to grow on me a little bit more. As you look over there, you see the continuously growing skyline. There is a legend that says uh, when they started building the tall skyscrapers in the mid 80s, uh, there was a legend that once they went past the statue of William Penn on City Hall, that there would be a curse that their sports teams would not win any more championships because they went past that. And that held true. And then in 2008, the second tallest building that you see there, next to the one with the point on the top, it, um, it was completed and some workers put a, a little mini statue of William Penn in it at the top of that building. So it, he was now again at the top of the city. And in 2008, the uh, Phillies did win the World Series. So some people said that that did break the curse of William Penn. All right, it's a little later in the day in the afternoon and we made it to what is commonly called the Rocky Stairs, made famous in the 1976 movie. People have been running up and down them the last few minutes while I've been up here. You can hear the Rocky theme playing in the background. They've actually moved the Rocky statue down over to the left there behind those trees. I think there was just too many people congregating here and it was kind of a mess, so they moved it. But I was gonna tell the story, I think I might have mentioned it earlier today, but for many, many years, the tallest building in all of Philadelphia was the City Hall with the statue of William Penn. In the 1980s, they did start to build some fairly decent skyscrapers here. Well, someone said, well, if, if Billy Penn or William Penn is not the tallest building in the city anymore, if he's not at the top, Philadelphia's sports teams will be cursed. Well, that was the case. They went to Super Bowls, they went to NBA Finals and all this kind of stuff and they could never win. And then people started talking more about this curse. And in 2008, when that building called the Comcast building was finished, some workers at the top, in the very top of the roof, put a little statue of William Penn and uh, the building was completed. That fall, Philadelphia did beat Tampa Bay in the World Series, breaking the curse of Billy Penn. They won their first title since the year 1980 when the Phillies had won the World Series previously. And the 76ers, sorry, had actually won it in 83. That had been the most recent one. And then since that time, they've built this other one. It's a little bit taller. And I'm pretty sure the workers probably put a statue of William Penn up there. But this is a very nice shot of the city of Philadelphia. It's a very hot, hot day today, but it's a nice day. <laughs> 